Okay, the first time I heard them, it wasn't on the radio. I was at a club in downtown New Brunswick, New Jersey. I was going to school at Rutgers University. And they first played Smells Like Teen Spirit by Nirvana, and we just went insane. And then they went right into Pearl Jam Even Flow. And right then, we just knew that what we're listening to, this music, was just so different, so unique. And we just knew that something special was just kind of going on out there musically. And we just kind of, just kind of woke up. It just woke us up, uh, my friends and I. And we just fell in love with this, this genre of music and just Pearl Jam specifically. And I just couldn't wait to get more of it. I went to Lollapalooza 92, and it was at Jones Beach in New York, and it was kind of a cloudy day, but it never occurred to us what would be happening. We saw, I think Lush played first, and then Pearl Jam was supposed to come on, and they kept delaying it. We didn't know what was going on. Then they canceled the concert because of lightning, and because Pearl, uh, the stage is kind of over the water, we were next to the water, and it was just the, the only Lollapalooza that was ever canceled. And we heard rumors that Pearl Jam was walking on the parking lot with her guitars and singing and everything, and we, we tried to find them, and we just, we just gave up. And that's the closest I ever came to seeing them, and it just, it just never happened. It's kind of like, I, I still feel like there's something missing in my, my musical history because I never actually got to see them. The song that inspires me the most and, and just means the most to me is Nothing Man. Um, that song is, it just transcend, transcends music. It's, it's really a, a poem and it's a story and uh, about two people who were connected and then they were no longer connected. And I think everyone can relate to that, but uh, when I heard that song for the first time, and I, and I still listen to that song. It's like it's the first time because it just reminds me to um, to move on from situations like that. When you're when you're when you're no longer connected with someone, uh, why be a part of that? Why put your energy into it? Just just keep on going. And uh, I, I actually owe a lot to that song. I owe a lot to it.